Hey, yo, guys, the fucking show is over. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo guys, back at Kellen's old crib here. Ah, the lighting in here is terrible. Anyways guys, um, I guess Diego and I are tearing down and packing up the truck by ourselves. Nobody else is here. God, guys, it is cold as hell outside right now. Ah, there we go, guys, back inside the cribbo. Nice and warm. Good lighting, finally. Ooh, look at that lighting. Yeah, let's go. There's always somebody in the group who fucks it up every single show. Like, somebody always has something going on, or somebody shows up later. Something happens every single show. Somebody fucks up. It hasn't really been me in a while. I think mine was like last summer. Right now it's kind of a mixture between Kellen and Peter. Kellen who's taking an exam, which we can't fault him for really, and Peter who's just late as fuck. So it's kind of his fault right now. Later. We've got like, we've got 20 minutes to make it to a place that's 50 minutes away. I don't care. Fuck it. I'm gonna take a nap. I'm gonna do a time time lapse of me just napping. Just... Yeah. Peter showed up like a fucking shadow, bro. I didn't even hear him come in. What the fuck? Yo, Peter, tell me about your empanada, bro. Hey, bro. It's gonna be the best empanada I'm gonna have in my life, bro. Do you know why? Because it's called the Empanada Express Girl, bro. Girl? Girl, bro. It's about a girl? It's... The empanada's about a girl. The empanada's about a girl? That's right. It sounds like you need pussy, bro. Bro! <laughs> <laughs> why else would you be so excited about that empanada? Bro, because I'm hungry. Well, yeah. What else could it be? I know. You've been hungry for two years, bro. Two years? Wait, what? <laughs> I was eating on in what? What was that? Oh, August? Hey. September? You've been hungry for a month. <laughs> hey. We eat today. You're right. You're right. Yo, what are you? Hey, you wanna go get empanadas right now? <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm fucking cold. <laughs> hey, Diego, let's just all go. I don't wanna fucking move. This thing focusing? Focus. Focus, motherfucker. Focus. So the first act started. Just now? Or maybe that's the second act, I don't know. <laughs> the most fire ball, but kind of didn't make sense. I guess this is not the only thing. I want to just go back to the other way. Is that a good We don't go out for like another hour, so we're gonna eat. What's that? I pause, bro. What? Hey, well, this is fucking Venezuela. I don't know shit about Venezuela. Let me get this in for you, bro. This is. This is. You need to make it really traditional. Look it up, bro, and then make that inertia. Wait, what, what vlog number is this? What vlog? I don't know, like 15. 16, right? I'm gonna say 13. Welcome to uh, Prison Palace vlog number 13. Question mark. I'm your host, Peter Sampagolan. And here's my guest host. Introduce yourself. Uh, my name is Hasyan. Give us that 360. All right, you only have one word to describe this. Wow. Oh yeah, that was like, I was like, what are you doing? Where'd she go? She's just like, this is supposed to be on your fucking head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we're just chilling at the Empanada place waiting for Peter's food. I think the show started already. There's like two acts that already went on. We're not here for them though. Fuck them. We're here for 20 minutes to get in and get out. Fuck this show. How do you feel? How do you feel? Drop some napkins. I feel like this is gonna be a great show, you know? Yeah. 
Uh, I think we'll get the first place, maybe second. It might just be like a popularity contest, so we'll see how it goes, you know. See how my food. <laughs> oh, cool. Is it the man? Bro, dude, right. we just, you yeah. just have it, bro. You just got into the frame, literally, you're right in the fucking frame. No, what a fucking it, asshole. I hope the mic guys can fucking hear this. It's probably straight out the frame, too. <laughs> I've got two exams tomorrow, guys. I'm supposed to be studying, I'm not supposed to be in a fucking empanada shop. What you mean? This is the place where you study. Yeah, what? Study what, the fucking water? <laughs> Bro, yeah. <laughs> Yo, cuz I'm the only one speaking Spanish, they brought me Peter's food because I don't fucking like his This is a, a food review. Oh, wait. You gotta be careful, man. Yeah, you gotta put on the speaking hat. <laughs> this is a food review featuring the hat. Alright. <laughs> I'll let you know how it goes. Alright. We'll be back. My knowledge of food. I'm gonna give you the overall rating right now, not the end. Seven out of ten. Seven. Now let me elaborate on that. Shredded chicken. It's like a good eight out of ten. Good seasoning. <coughs> not too tender. Not too dry. It's kind of dry, but uh, <laughs> sour cream. It's sour cream, right? You can't do anything about it, right, right there. Right. 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 But when you get a a little salty. Whoa. A little salty. Now, these beans can't taste them. From went from a nine to an eight. It's salty. It's salty. Can it's I salty. try it, Peter? Seven out of ten. Seven. Final verdict. That's seven out of ten. Let's go to the egg oh. side. So, Russ, I'm about to run out of fucking memory before like we even get to the show. And we'll see you at the show, boys. It's gonna be the, it's gonna be the empanada review. <laughs> Ooh, dude, somebody's got sick. Wait, we didn't even... I don't know about the empanadas, but those burritos were pretty good. Man, vegan not looking too good, boys. <laughs> if, I'm, if I'm out in the middle... Oh my god. You feel it? You about to shit yourself, Peter. Hey, he's getting $100 for free. We have to go on right? We gotta go. It looks scary as fuck. Yeah, I got you. Look at that. Okay, we're about, we're about to go on, guys. The show's about to start. Uh, I'm, using, I'm using my phone as light because you can't see shit in here. But is it, it's about to go down. My boy Hasim right here, he's gonna record for us, of course, so let's get ready for it.
Guys, the fucking show is over. Oh my god. Bro, that shit was a blast, oh bro. Oh my god. I don't know what he means. You don't that know what I mean because blast. I haven't fucking told you yet, but that shit was straight trash. It wasn't that bad, but it was pretty fucking bad. It was like him. it was like your fucking nightmares coming true it, like in front of your eyes. For him. It was like that. I got shadow. Like how? Yeah, my fucking, my fucking bass it. decided to break oh, down. It, it fuck my bass fucking broke before the show. Yeah. I didn't know it was working last night. Yeah. Fucking thing just breaks. The fucking bass just collapsed. The fucking bass just decided to collapse on me. It just died. I mean, oh my god. So I just kept doing it. <laughs> that's why. That's why we stopped. That's why I stopped the fucking song. I stopped. You were enraged though, huh? I was fucking. Kellen was raging. Kellen was raging. Was just like, I was like, what the fuck? Yeah. The Kellen was the one who was like, Ooh. fuck. I know. Really? What did he say? Yeah, Kellen was raging. So yeah, my bass fucking broke mid set. The thing decided, no, not even mid set. I didn't, my bass didn't make it to the fucking show. It just died. I had to borrow some other guys' bass. The top string just kept popping out of popping out of tune. It was it was a mess. Does he have a bolt? Yeah. My bass decided it just not work tonight. Like I was turning it on, the amp was just screeching. I had to borrow some other dude's bass who was nice enough to lend it to me. But then this dude had like way too thick strings on his on his bass. So the top string, the E string, just kept coming off the nut, and it was just hanging there, and it would go out of tune. So I sounded like shit half the time. <laughs> it was it was just a fucking mess. This whole this whole show was a mess. Every it feels like every show something goes wrong. Flashback. If something happens every single show. Somebody fucks up. End of flashback. And you know what? Isn't it's not that bad when we actually played the songs like everything was going fine. We sounded great I think the people were into it but in between the songs while I was trying to desperately tune or Right before the show when I was trying to find a bass there was a lot of stuff happening and it was just fucked up It, it was not good. So Anyways guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy this confusing mess of a vlog we spent so much time at the uh, empanadas place <laughs> it was hardly even a show vlog thank you for watching guys make sure to subscribe for the next couple weeks I'm actually gonna be on my own I'm going to California so I'm gonna be doing vlogs from there it's gonna be more of the Aaron show than the prison palace show but I'll keep posting them on this channel so you guys can watch uh, yeah I think that's it thanks guys thank you for watching just one one last look at toad here what up toad say hi to the people Alright, make sure to subscribe and we'll catch you in the next one.